Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and this is Dead Carpet Energy Drink Review since 4.40 p.m. And it's Friday, May 24th, 2024. Yesterday I went to Texas and I stopped at Bucky's and I got a new shirt. Um, but yeah, I got um, two energy drinks there that I haven't reviewed before. Um, I just reviewed one of them in my last review, the Melon Blast NoCo BCA Energy Drink. Um, but today I'm going to be reviewing another NoCo BCA Energy Drink. This one has 200 milligrams of caffeine. The one I reviewed in my last review had 180. So this one's a little bit stronger than that one. But um, this one sounds like it might be pretty good. We shall see. It was like around $2 and something a can, but it was like two for four something. So it's better if you, if you get the two can deal, you know, just saying. But um, anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing the Juicy Raz NoCo BCA Energy Drink. So, oh yeah, boys, look at that can. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Very blue can. Goes good with my blue shirt. Um, So, yeah. Anyways, a silver top with a light blue tab with a wide mouth European style top opening. The bomb's the Best Buy Dayton production code, Best Buy January 28th, 2025. So it's still fresh for a while. A little bit hard to see. The can is like sweating, and I'm sweating too. It's like almost 90 degrees today. It's like 88 degrees, but it probably feels like 90 in my car before I started it. Um, but um, anyway. NoCo BCA Juicy Raz Raspberry Flavored Sugar Free and Carmated Beverage with other natural flavors. Caffeine 200 milligrams, 12 fluid ounces, 355 milliliters. Has like a polka dot or like dotted background pattern towards the bottom of the can and also towards the top of the can around the rim. But um, this one has a little bit of like a different color shade of blue than the other NoCo cans. Um, because I guess to make it, you know, it's like one of the stronger ones, you know, just saying. So it's a little bit more of a different design. Um, but um, anyway, has the equal sign. Noco, juicy ras raspberry flavored with other natural flavors. Contains 1% apple juice. Produced in the Netherlands. Manufactured for No Carbs LLC. 3865 Grandview Boulevard, Los Angeles, California, 90066. Branch chain amino acids. BCA blend is 4 to 1 to 1 ratio. Leucine, valine. And isoleucine, 3,000 milligrams, caffeine, 200 milligrams. Not recommended for children, pregnant, breastfeeding, and women are individual sensitive to caffeine. Low calorie beverage, we recommend a maximum consumption of two cans per day. Best served chilled, once open, consumed same day. www.noco.com at noco.usa, info.us at noco.com. Has some other codes the CP Can Company logo, 12 ounces, 305 milliliters on the SKU. Nutrition facts, starting size one can, not more certain calories, 15. Total fat, 0 grams over cent. Sodium, 0 grams over cent. Total carbohydrates, 2 grams, 1%. Total sugar, 0 grams. Include 0 grams added sugar, 0%. Protein, 2 grams, 0%. I had to turn off my car's air conditioner more. It's like really humid and hot. Like really sweaty. Um, but anyway, I said 8 milligrams, 50%. Vitamin B6, 0 0.85 milligrams, 50%. Vitamin B12, 1.2 micrograms, 50%. Biotin, 15 micrograms, 50%. Then it has the other ingredients. Carbonated water, eleusine, citric acid, natural raspberry flavor, WANF. This is like one of the messed up cans. I had another can that I had before that said WANF. I'm not for sure what that's supposed to mean. Um, but yeah. Apple juice from concentrate, L-valine, L-isoleucine, caffeine, sucralose, carrot juice. Um, concentrate for color, natural and artificial grape flavor. Nice and vitamin B6, by 10 and vitamin B12 as is neg sorry, adds a negligible amount of sugar. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much the entire can. But um, anyway, I'll let you see it right quick. I'm gonna wipe off the can again. Already showed you the top and the bottom, but um, anyway. I like the font where it has the Raz with the long R. Reminds me of like some sort of like um vintage, like sort of like a retro type of jazz design on it. How to really describe it, you know what I mean? Their codes in the SKU. Now for the nutrition facts side. And this is another messed up can where the 
sugar and the carbohydrates isn't like capitalized. So it's supposed to be capitalized. Okay, that's pretty much the entire can, but I'm anyway. I'm gonna show off the can up closer quick. So hold on a minute. The Juicy Raz Noco BCA Energy Drink. This one's one of the stronger ones. This one has 200 milligrams caffeine instead of 180. This one's a light blue can instead of like a dark blue. Well, darker blue, but um, the other ones are still light though, but you want them in. It has a silver top with a light blue, baby blue tab. European style wide mouth top opening. Bombs Best Buy Dayton production code. I don't know if it's going to focus. January 28th, 2025, so it's still fresh for a while. Noco BCAA Juicy Raz. It's raspberry flavored. It's like a polka dot pattern at the bottom of the can and at the top a little bit. It's not one to focus though too much. It contains 1% apple juice. It's interesting. My phone's having like focusing problems again, so hopefully it'll stay fixed. Other code in the SKU. Now for the nutrition pack side. Other ingredients. Okay, that's pretty much the entire can. Anyway, now I'm gonna finish my review for it. So hold on a minute. Okay, I shut off the can up close and I'm gonna shake it up a little bit. Open it, taste it, and give my review for it. So hold on a minute. Okay, it says it has carrot juice for color. Um, yep, this one's not clear. This one has a little bit of like a um pinkish tint to it. I try not to spill it on the white part of my new shirt. I'm trying to get a little bit out of the top of the can so you can see the color. Okay. Yeah, it has a little bit of like a, um, like a tint of pink to it. Definitely looks like a raspberry drink, I guess. A little bit carbonated, but in many ways the scent. Whoa, 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 well, 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 well. It's definitely the type of raspberry scent that I don't like too much. It has that like um earthy, natural, sort of like a healthy, bitter type of raspberry scent. Definitely not like a sweet raspberry. Definitely like a way stronger type of raspberry scent. Um, yeah, definitely does not smell like the um raspberry um, monster rehab. This one has a way of a more of a stronger, darker sort of scent. I don't know about this one. I don't know about this one. This one smells definitely really strong. But um, anyway, and I'm gonna try it. So here goes. Well, 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 well. And yep. Definitely tastes sweeter than it smelled. The scent was definitely way more of like a stronger type of raspberry scent. But um, taste wise, it's actually definitely way sweeter. And um, yeah, it's not too carbonated. You can probably check it if you want to. It's a little bit fizzy. Um, but yep, still definitely has a strong, very pungent raspberry flavor. Like really, really, really noticeable raspberry flavor. It's probably the strongest raspberry drink I've had. Definitely a way stronger of a raspberry taste than like the um, Raspberry Tea Monster Rehab. That one's like a way lighter, sweeter sore taste, but um, this one's still sweet, but um, definitely stronger though. Definitely a little bit more bitter and definitely a little bit more tart. It's like if you got like a, um, like a handful of like real raspberries and like mushed it to down, you know, and then try to eat that like mush stuff, you know, um, that's what this tastes like. So you know, in like a liquid form. Um, so yeah, definitely a really strong raspberry flavor. It tastes like, um, like you're drinking raspberry jam or something. 
Definitely an interesting flavor. Um, it definitely tastes better than I thought it would taste, um, judging by the smell, because yeah, the smell it would have been a no for me. Um, yeah, definitely doesn't taste earthy though, but um, yeah, definitely had like an earthy type of smell though. Um, definitely like an herbaly, like strong sort of scent, but um, taste-wise though, it's definitely way sweeter than that though, so what I mean, but um, yeah, it's good, but um, not my favorite raspberry drink, definitely prefer like the um, Raspberry Monster Rehab over this. Um, but this is okay though, but um, energy-wise, it'll still definitely be pretty less 200 milligrams of caffeine, it has the B vitamins and stuff, so I'll still say energy-wise, um, lasts about four and a half hours, about five and a half hours of energy, and work a little bit more, it's really strong, um, it also has the BCAs, you know, um, so yeah, you probably still shouldn't drink, have any anxiety problems, but yeah, energy-wise, it works pretty good, it's okay priced, around two, four, four, something at Bucky's. um, quick trips also carry the NOCO energy drinks, but um, my quick trip didn't have the Melon Blaster one or this one, I um, only found these so far at the Bucky's, so definitely be on the lookout for it though. Um, yeah, judging by the smell though, um, I thought it would be way worse. Um, but yeah, the taste is actually pretty good. Um, definitely um, sweet, but um, I don't know, could be a little bit more of a lighter, sweeter taste. Um, sweet though, but um, also a little bit bitter and strong at the same time, see what I mean? But yeah, really, really raspberry. It's like um some raspberry jam I had that had like these like pits in it, like these like little type of seed things. It reminds me of that. Um, but yeah, it's not bad, but um, yeah, it could be better though. See so what I mean? Um, actually, I think I like it about the same as the melon blast one I had earlier, but um, I still prefer the melon blast one over this one though. See so what I mean? But um, it's still okay though. Um. I don't know if I should give it like a high 8 out of 10 or like a low 9. Um, not really for sure about this one. You know what, boys? You know what? I'm going to give it the Juicy Raz Noco BCA Energy Drink. I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. So, oh yeah, boys, it's still lit. So, oh yeah, it's lit. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. Energy wise, it still works really good. So, okay, price has a cool can design. Like the blue and the stuff, and the blue and the red color combination looks pretty cool. Um, if you like raspberry jam, you'll probably like this because um, this tastes really similar to that, like natural raspberries, you know. But yeah, um, the scent reminded me a little bit of like um, I had a like a um, like a black currant drink before. Um, this reminds me of that a little bit, judging by the smell, you know. It smelled similar to that, but um, doesn't taste like that though, so that's good. Yeah, this one's definitely way raspberry, but um, for a raspberry drink though, it's not bad, but um, yeah, it could be better though. Um, not my favorite raspberry drink, but I'm um, still actually pretty good, so yeah, I'm gonna give it a 9 out of 10. Um, anyway, stay more upcoming reviews, some more videos. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Peace out, and bye.